guys, Barbara here. I hope you're having a wonderful day today. I'm going to be trying this recipe that I've been seeing pop up all over Facebook. In that recipe, the people are making teriyaki chicken. I'm going to make pineapple chicken and I'm going to serve it with white rice inside a pineapple bowl. You're watching The Bear Pantry Show. To make this dish, we're going to need some pre-cooked chicken tenderloins. This is a large onion that I sliced up into big chunks. We're going to need a can of pineapple tidbits, a tablespoon and a half of cornstarch, a big bowl to mix up everything in, some water, three tablespoons of light brown sugar, and two tablespoons of light soy sauce. I'm going to use half of this fresh pineapple and definitely the whole peel, okay? This dish is going to be made with white rice, so let me go ahead and take care of this. Now, I don't normally do anything to my white rice more than rinse it off and make sure the water level is correct to cook it in the rice cooker. I always use the tip of my finger to measure that. I put it in the rice cooker and hit the on button and walk away. Now, it's time to take care of the chicken tenderloins. Look at the price. It was a lot cheaper than boneless, skinless thighs, though. My shears are clean. Let me just go ahead and cut this into some big chunks and then wash it off with some white distilled vinegar. Let me run it under the faucet, guys. And I'm not gonna use ricotta or paprika or any of that stuff on this, okay? Just salt, pepper, and cayenne. Get it worked in really, really well. And then now I'm gonna move over to the stove to fry these. Some people use a lot less oil than I'm using, but I want mine to be deep fried, okay? So now they're ready after about 15 minutes of frying. Let me drain them in the colander. And then move over to the counter. Let me drain my pineapple juice, add the soy sauce, now the brown sugar. Let me go ahead and get this to dissolve. And now work on the thickener. I'm working on everything now because we're going to move back over the stove and it's going to move pretty fast, okay? So now over to the stove in a clean skillet. Let me add my soy sauce mixture, then my tidbits. Now let me go ahead and work on my fresh pineapple. All right, guys, so I'm going to just slice this baby open straight down. Mm-hmm. So I went this way already with this little peering knife and I'm going this way just so I can get it out neatly. From the fresh pineapple, I'm only using a half. I'm going to give Jada the next half because she was dying for it. Let me go ahead and add my onions and I just want the onions to saute for a little bit. And then now the thickener, which is the cornstarch mixture. Now it's time for me to add the pre-cooked chicken. Pretty easy, right? and just go ahead and give us a stir until it's well incorporated. And now it's time to plate this, and this is why I've been so excited all week to do this dish. It's because I wanna do it like this to make it look all tropical. Let me go ahead and put the chicken in here. Isn't it gorgeous, guys? Now let me go ahead and show you my thumbnail pictures. Check this out, and look at this one close up. Oh my goodness, I can't wait to taste this dish. I'm so glad that I tried this and I'm even happier that I did not do teriyaki. I really don't like the taste of teriyaki so that's why I opted out of not doing that. Plus I wanted to use some of the fresh pineapple in the dish and so I think this came out really really awesome and I can't wait to taste it in a few seconds for you okay. I want to thank you guys so much for watching the show, for liking, for subscribing, for sharing, for commenting and for everything else that you do to support me. Until I see you guys again, take care. Thank you so much for watching, liking, and subscribing. Please check out my other channels, the Product Review Channel, My Family Vlogs, and Joe's Channel. You can find all the links in the description box below.